Little cabin we rented in St. Helen. It's a little rustic. Little bathroom in there. Give you a quick walk around, shower. Not fancy, good enough. Bathroom, shower, and uh, heat and cool in it. That's really all we need for ATV in. So there's a the cabin. So here we are in St. Helen, getting ready to take our new Suzuki King Quad 750s out for their first ride. We rented this cute little cabin. And there's Bob waiting for me to hurry up and get going. We're getting this ready way. to take them out for their first break-in ride, 10 hours at half throttle or less, varying speeds. That's our goal today here in St. Helen, Michigan. And there they are. Kind of the off-roading Mecca town. A beautiful lake here, all kinds of nice trails. You can take your Jeep side-by-sides, ATVs, dirt bikes, you name it here. St. Helens, very, very off-road, outdoor friendly. So if you're ever thinking about somewhere to visit Michigan for that type of thing, this is the place to go, St. Helen, Michigan. And there's mine, clean as it'll ever be. Still only two miles on it. Never be cleaner. I want to take a real quick clip because I said I'd show you the trunk organizer once I had it in there. And there it is. As you can see, see, there's a little open space for the cooler to go. Right there. I've got a bunch of waters in it, some snacks, and we're getting ready to head out. So we're in St. Helen, Michigan. Just rented this place. Getting ready to take our quads out for their first ride. So the first 10 hours, owner's manual says keep it half throttle or less and keep your speeds varying. It says basically you want to put some load on the engine, just not too much, um, whatever that means. Get ready to take them out on their first ride. inch or less which is really the fun part of it you see though i don't know if the camera's picking it up it looks like some of this has been groomed but then they make it really tight
bad trail for breaking your quad in though because you're going to go varying speeds and you're never going to use more than half throttle so kind of perfect for that kind of run there's little signs there to tell you atvs and dirt bikes only on this that's the first time i've been on these trails so i'll look it up and maybe type on the description where we are so far i'm starting to kind of like them not bad